Welcome back guys. This is Jason, KM4ACK. Today, let's take a look at my broken Raspberry Pi. Stick around and we'll get right to it. Okay, so this is a Raspberry Pi that I built about a month ago to go along with my new 891 uh, right after I purchased it. It's a Raspberry Pi 4 running the latest Buster. Uh, it was built with a beta version of build a pi 2 uh, Up until yesterday, everything has been working great with this setup. Uh, yesterday I did a POTA activation. I was going to work voice, so I didn't even take the Raspberry Pi with me. I just shut it down and left it here in the shack and uh, went out and did the POTA activation. When I came back and started hooking everything back up, booted into this Raspberry Pi, you'll notice all of my Conky information is gone. So I started trying to troubleshoot this. Uh, so what I did first was pulled up the terminal window and I'm checking to see if Conky is running. So PID of space Conky. And I see that it does have a process ID number. So Conky is running but it's not displaying. Now, I tried several different things uh, to figure out what's wrong with Conky and why it wouldn't display. I finally stumbled upon this, and guys, I don't have an answer for this. Uh, so continue watching, but I ended up having to go to a backup. Sometimes things just uh, get a little squirrely, and I'm not even sure how to fix it occasionally. But what I did was I ran CGPS, and I wanted to take a look at my GPS data. Well, the GPS has just given me an error. So something's not right right here. It should at least tell me that it doesn't have a fix or something along those lines. So I got out of that. I even tried uh, XGPS, which is another one uh, that will pull up. Uh, and let's see if I can turn off that sky view. See, I should have some information here, even if it says no fix. Um, not sure what happened. Literally, I shut the pie down, I came back, I booted back up, and I have this issue. Now, the reason I know that it is definitely a GPS problem, let me clear that screen. I'm going to run nano uh, dot conky rc. And I'm going to come down, whoop, wrong button. I want to come down inside of this file and find, uh, let's see, this line right here that's got grid square in it. I'm going to comment that line out by putting a pound sign in front of it. I'm going to press Control X, Y, and Enter to get out. And now, uh, let's see, let's run PID of Conky again. Conky's still running, so I'm going to kill it with Conky, or I'm sorry, kill space hyphen 9 1356, which is its process number. So let's kill that and let's try to restart it again with just typing Conky from the command line. And there you go, you'll see that Conky did come back up onto the screen for us that time. So what I initially thought was a Conky issue turns out to not be a Conky issue. It's some sort of issue with reading my GPS. I poked around at it a little while uh, last night, but honestly, I just didn't want to go down a rabbit hole. Uh, what I do want to stress here is keep your systems backed up. That way, when you run into one of these little uh, glitches like this, and this is the first time I've run into it with a GPS, but when you do run into it, sometimes it's quicker just to fall to a backup rather than try to troubleshoot uh, something that's just kind of odd going on. So I grabbed a backup. It was about two weeks old. I'm not going to lose too terribly much, but I am back up and running now. All right, guys. I uh, hope you found it helpful. Moral of the story, back up your pie. We'll see you guys on the next video. Until then, 7-3.